Five, and I was like, part four. So, little like things I need to do just to catch up. If you didn't save, tweet, which I doubt you did. Uh, I forgot to save at the end of last thing, so I redid everything. Uh, which means there were some changes. So basically on the redo, I got rid of Triton and acquired as soon as I started, which means I bumped up some XP gain. So I just avoided Wild Encounters until I got a uh, new Pokemon, which were luckily the same. I got another Voltorb, uh, got another Voltorb, Zubat, and another Growlithe. Uh, they were pretty similar. Uh, the only thing that's different is that they probably have different um, they probably have different natures, which is a little bad, but that's fine. Um, and I forgot to actually name Voltorb Yarbolan like last time. So in my heart, he's Yarbolan until we actually get to um, until we get to Celadon, where I can change his name. I think it's Celadon, but for now, he's just a Voltorb. But he's a Yarbolan. So today, we have our friends here. Dante, we need to get him ready for the fight. Uh, I want him, Storm, and Raph and Rickard to really go in. Aquara should not enter. Jensen, Dante are probably the two strongest. Jensen because of speed and most of the type advantages. Surprisingly, a lot of Pokemon uh, Grass Poison, except for Tangela, uh, which will probably either be Storm or Dante's thing. So those are the top three one in this fight. Rickard is there because of Aerial Ace, but otherwise I wouldn't really want to put him in. So, we don't want to get higher than around the level we are for everyone at 29. So we're just going to do a bit of grinding for, um, thing. So, before we do that, we're going to quickly head over to, uh, head over to the area where Celadon is to fight the trainers there. If there are any, if I remember or not. So we're just doing that little part. So today I just want to get Gen. F I want to get Gym Four done. Uh, got rid of you. I think you're a different route, but I don't know if you have anything different. Seven. I'm avoiding that grass for now. Uh, I'll go. I'll go check my phone, which is actually working my desk at the moment, so I might quickly grab that while uh, while we're starting up here. So let me just move us back to where we want to do. Set up our Verse Seeker. Yeah, so we're just gonna try and Verse Seeker for a bit, try and get him ready to fight on his own until he reaches everyone. So we might actually do bushes for a little bit. He, he can take anything in a bush at the moment, and then we'll, once he's around 2022, 20, I think we'll get him to fight people. So now I'll get my stuff and we'll be right back. Let me know if that, uh, that uh, the fan is too loud or not, because it's just a little bit hot here right now, so I would like to keep a little bit cool. Uh, but yeah, we'll play some Pokemon music and uh, do what we usually do here. And, uh, do some speed up. I just want to get him around 20, 27, 28, 29. 
Because that's where everyone else is going to be. I don't want to get much further than 29. That's what uh, her final Pokemon is going to be. Also, let me know about the music. It's too loud or not. the stab even though I believe his strength is oh that's very lucky on that his part let's actually have a quick look at his stats over here so he has timid nature I don't remember what that is, but yeah, so the only couple things that will change between the Pokemon have been their abilities, maybe, and then their, uh, their, uh, their natures is the only two things that would have super changed about them. I, I didn't want to actually go and try and get everyone to be exactly the I prefer, that would take a, a, a lot of effort, uh. Not that I'm not unwilling to do, it's just that it'll, it'll, it would have been a while I'm just walking out a while to look for a specific nature Pokemon. So, Timid seems to be Speed for Attack. Not the best. I mean, it both like good, having him run faster is extremely good and his attack's pretty good anyway. Uh, and I mean, he might be a we might make him just more fire based in the end then, but otherwise it's not the worst the thing that he's got. Right now all he has is special attack, which is a little annoying. Which is a whirlwind and not gonna be helpful with this grind. One stage down of defense. Oh, okay. Echoes. Got Charboka in our thing, leveling up slowly, which is cool. Okay, heal after that. There'll be a lot of this for a little bit. Um, sorry, but that's how it is. I've noticed that on personal Nuzlocke that I do, this is where I tend to lose most of my Pokemon. Is when I'm grinding up a new member, I tend to lose them because they can't sustain on their own. Uh, because I don't want to overlevel my other party. So I'm trying to be... To like avoid that I'm gonna be a lot more uh, diligent to keeping them alive. Even from this, we'll just take a little bit of damage and then it dies. So I've also thought about I'm going to cement Wednesdays as the Nuzlocke days. Uh, and I was thinking maybe of doing streams on Thursdays, but I won't know what to play and if I want to do that at the moment. Uh, but yeah, that would be my... That would be like the most ideal. Like, you guys see my Friday games, my whole like weekend is packed up with D&D stuff. So I, don't, I tend to like use that as for days of going out with people and friends and stuff. So, um, yeah, so that's, if I'm, if I'm gonna stream tomorrow, I don't know what I'll play, like, I've got a very couple ideas, there's Phoenix Rat, I love that series to death, um, I wouldn't mind playing it, but there's also Yakuza, I, I bought that, because that seems like my favorite game, uh, not Black Dragon, the lead in Yakuza 0, uh, there's also Nair, I've never played that, well, I wonder if I want to play a game that I have played before, or I haven't played before. I might just slay the spire, and then I might get help from chat for that. Because I don't, I really don't know what I'm doing with it. Like, I don't often get wins. I've been getting them a lot more, and I've been playing a lot better recently. 
But I'm not really doing much. I don't think I'm really good at the game yet. Once he's 20, we'll send him out against some of the trainers. Uh, see if he can take on... Because right now he's squishy. If I believe his defences are not the best. 24, 25... Day. Yeah, they're the worst on the team. Like... He's only... Like... Even Jensen's got a stronger physical defense than he does at the moment, which is not the goodest. So, it's not the best. So we'll try and fix that up, won't we? Heyday. Grind time is fun time. Fake is going to be fun. Potentially. Potentially the finale of Strahd. Depends on what the people do in the game. But. I think this might be the end. Might not be the final episode. There might be an, an epilogue. But there might. You know, this might be it. With Strahd himself out to play. And then I've got. Uh, Hopefully I've got some D&D in the weekend to play. Uh, but yeah, I'm having a lot of fun time. This week's been very relaxing. Like, I haven't been doing as much as I have been doing the last couple weeks. And I've been actually been able to sit down and play some games to a good extent. I've uh, recently, on Monday, I was catching all the bird Pokemon and stuff and... Uh, Isle of Armor, finishing all that DLC off because I didn't really do it um, when it came out. So I was finishing that off and then I have to go back to. Oh no, Isle of Armor, Crown Tundra. I need to go back and finish Isle of Armor. Uh, I've got, I'm up to the hop stuff there and I want to get all the Diglets. And I mean, there's also caching every Pokemon. I did that. I've done that once already, which is annoying, but. Good to have backups, I guess. Having some fun with Pokemon. And then once everything's like settled down with that game, I'm probably gonna like, head back to Zelda. And like, continue my bad choices in that game. Because I've not finished Breath of the Wild yet. I've started it when it came out and then I took a very long break because of other games and I recently got back into it during quarantine and I was like I am going to do stupid things in Zelda like do all the temples, uh, do, all, do all the shrines, complete the codex or the, the compendium and I'm going to also get every Korok scene so my whole playtime with that game is here's the is like an interactive map but this is where you need to go to collect Korok seeds go do that and like of course I'm silly I want to do everything in order I want the last thing to do uh, before fighting Ganon uh, go, fighting, going to the Hyrule Castle is to get the the Master Sword that's the like the last thing I want to do uh, and then I know there's stuff to empower and stuff later I'm pretty sure so it's like, that's going to be the last thing, is getting my weapon ready to fight him. And then I want to do... I don't know if I want to do Champion's Ballad before or after that. Because... I don't know, I think there'll be thematic doing Champion's Ballad before fighting him. Uh, but it's also like... 
that could finish the game. But it's, that's been a very fun Zelda. I enjoy my Zeldas quite a bit, and that's been a very fun time. Even if it is, like, systematically doing everything in order to get, like, all the Korok seeds, etc. That's, it's been a very, like, fun, chill time for me sitting down and having fun with that game. I tend to do, like, a lot of the same chilling tendencies with, uh... Pokemon like this, like just grinding in Sun and not Sun and Moon, the latest one. Uh, Sword and Shield, I did not, I haven't used an experience candy. Like, I tend not to. It's just I enjoy grinding Pokemon. I don't know why, I think it's maybe therapeutic. Uh, oh, thought I had you selected, but yeah. Ah, I feel like this is the refresh. Let's do this. So, good thing about the Vesic, as long as you don't go too far, you can do this stuff. I should switch Rickard out. He doesn't need any more levels. Actually, is bad. Thank God, she's not a fairy type in this game. What are they? Both fairies in from onwards. I don't remember. Sup, Albinger. Oh. You know, remember that if I'm not on the thing, it doesn't play. So, I'm going to grind up some fun. Ooh, that's good. That's not good. <laughs> I'm gonna keep him in there as long as I can, because he needs to level up. Now I'll switch for Jensen. Get that quick kill. Let's us get some healing. I don't know that. It reduces uh, attack as well, which is very interesting. Lets you stay in a bit longer if you get a burn off. But with that, Choir will come into play. So Choir should be the one I'll be should be throwing in more often than the other two, because they are not seeing the gym at all. Uh, so they should just stay in the back and hide forever. Uh, up until the next gym. But uh, for now, it's fine. That's that. Heal. We'll go do that again. Um, he couldn't really get through a whole team by himself, but that will only improve. I think he's got the need around team if he's not poisoned. which is A because I need to and B because I lack big numbers at the bottom, small numbers at the top. Order of grind. Let's do that. Get rid of that. I'm going to focus. Eclifer is gone with that, which is good. And while uh, Storm is not going to do much damage to Jigglypuff because of her physical abilities, uh, Dante will do plenty. The nerd wants to fight. I don't know what he's got. Coughing? Yeah, he can probably take on the coffin as long as he doesn't even blow itself up. He cannot take on the coffin. Whoops. <laughs> Uh, 
being a little risky here. A little risky. Just as long as I don't summon Jensen, or if Jensen doesn't have to fight for too long. That was silly of you. Pikachu is also being silly. It's fine by me. This train is probably the most annoying. But it also has the most potential XP gain. Uh, okay. So Clara's not going to be fighting anymore. Okay, okay, so you're on a 14, 20. So if I can go 6 blocks, f 5 blocks per each, and I want to stop at 13, I can move about 50 squares. So we'll figure that out. 1, 2, 3, 4, Want to be conservative? Um, I want to be conservative with my antidotes because uh, I mean I can buy more. I, I should buy more, but I just want to want to be safe with the number I have. So right now. We have been doing a bit more grinding. I think when everyone else hits 29, we'll stop and then we'll just do the gym and we'll grind from the gym for him. Because uh, I think he can handle that. Uh, but until everyone else is 29, he can get out. He can quickly get some levels out here by himself. <sighs> he is so unlucky with this poisons lately. So get the Eevee there. I don't know what I want to get out of the Eevee. I think I might leave it until I see if someone leaves or dies. Um, otherwise, I'll like because Vaporeon is very good. Like I know Valerion isn't the best, but it can be in this scenario. Thirty should be fine. I'm gonna make silly mistakes like that. But, yeah, but, uh, forgot what I was saying. Uh, but with the EV, yeah, Jolteon's probably the best, like, out of the lot. He covers, uh, a type that we don't have. Took that crit. 
out of everyone, I just want to do him because I think coughing gives him much experience out of everything here. So I'll just do a sneaky quick Jensen uh, side beam, and then we'll go heal up. Because uh, Storm is not healthy at the moment, right? Yeah, she took a bit in that fight, so it's fine. Come back, and then we'll yeah, we'll do sell We'll explore for a bit, go back to normal speed. So what we're gonna do there. The double. No, no double. Okay. I think he can take on this trainer. It's just the poison has been very like very good at hitting him from this meter end. He's been getting off a couple good burns as well, even off Ember. <sighs> Again. <laughs> Alright, guess we'll heal and... Yeah, we'll heal and go to Celadon now. So, pause the music. Heal, please. So. Pause the music. Then we'll go ahead. Zoom, game as usual. A little bit of a, but it should be fine soonish. Yeah, it's what happens when you go from the throttle to the not throttle. But <laughs> he zoomed around a bit. It's pretty fast. Yeah, I think we can grind him in the gym and relatively be okay. So it's fine. And then we'll go do under uh, Saladon. What do we want to do? Team Rocket first. I think we'll do Team Rocket after the gym, if we can. Uh, and I mean, I, could, I guess we can gamble. So, as I said last time, I'm not going to count gifts as breaking the rule because they were given to me. Um, I'll say, though, that I'll either have to choose between playing the slots or fish in here, most likely I'll play the slots, it's a Dratini there, like, why wouldn't I? Um, oh, it's quite rude. It's just gonna punch me for talking to him, I don't even care what he's doing here. I don't wanna talk to this man, he stares at girls in windows. I should look up when I should evolve him. I don't know if I want to give him something before he evolves or not. Uh, I might do that. Put the other side here. Just a normal nice luck at the moment. Uh, I typically haven't I haven't done a randomized run yet. I wanna I might do that afterwards for hot gold. Um, for now this is just a normal standard one. I don't really play fire red a lot. I'm usually more of the leaf green people, so I have different parties all the time. It's a good place for him to level up quickly. I just wanted to really give him up to a level where he could do this, where he can fight things and not die. Sunspool, my best friend. Egglock, Nuzlocke. 
Egg look? What's an egg look? I'm very vanilla with my nose looks. Flamethrower at 49. That might be it. Let's quickly have a look at Arcanines there. I don't really feel like I need to go here. You know, I've got 8 Paralyzed Hills, so. But it's being annoying. Okay. At yeah, 49, he wins extreme speed. So I guess we'll go to 49 to switch out flamethrower. Um, but otherwise, this seems pretty good to me. So here will be a growlithe still. And we'll leave after this fight now. This poison's not good. Oh. <laughs> it's perfectly fair. <sighs> oh, that sounds... That could be fun. It would be terrifying, because it would be level 1. Um, but that sounds fun. You wouldn't start off with the neck, that's that'd be impossible, because you can't you'd have to have a perk one. So yeah, you start off with the starter and then you get a bunch of eggs. Hmm. Interesting. I like the idea. It'll be <laughs> really unnecessarily hard, but also fun. Get a Eggs were randomized too. Oof. Yeah, well that emerald maybe? That might be a fun emerald run. Egg lock on, on emerald? I'll have a look into that. 
Level one. Give me a level one Osseus, and I'll do it. Let's go. Level one Osseus. So yeah, I think yeah, I think if this goes like well, uh, series we'll do a randomizer for Gen two, which will be actually Gen four because I'm playing Hulk Gold. And then yeah, if uh, <laughs> we'll do Emerald or Oras, Egg Nuzlocke if we can. That would be silly. I'm not gonna enjoy that. Emerald is hard. Uh, and so is Heart Gold. Uh, cause you don't have Verse Seeker. Verse Seeker is the only thing that works for this game. Um, yes we are winning. Uh, it's the only thing that works for this game because you don't have, like, boosted experience or anything. So, Gen 3 and 4 are not the best when it comes to thing. And everyone has a problem where the routes, they don't really get strong enough to be worth the experience to get. Um, like, you don't, like, you can fight the routes, but then there's just, there's no, like, the experience game is so slow in that regard. Ah, uh, if I get, yeah, if I, if I can borrow my brother's, uh, Elgato, I might. Yeah, like, I'll, <laughs> I'll get him to breed me a bunch of Pokemon, and we'll send it over into, a uh, Sword and Shield Nuzlocke. I might do that, that'd be fun. Yeah, I'll, I'll have him breed some random Pokemon and I'll spend the first thing, like every session of her. It has to be random? Yeah, well, the randomness isn't me. Like, the randomness is someone else, like, sending me a random egg. Takedown for what? Leah, Roar. Roar is not helpful. Or is it? It's less helpful than me. Yeah, I think for that I'd have to get someone else to repair an egg a day. Or like try even stockpile eggs and then I'll send them over one by one in like order of a box. Just a roll a die in a, like a roll of D30. I don't think Dante will sweep. I have a feeling I'll be using Jensen a lot more. Uh, for some type of advantages and he goes a lot quicker. But Dante has the potential to sweep, yes. But yeah, like if they could give me anything, like, I don't know, I might ask a bunch of my friends and then we'll send it over onto my normal game. And then, yeah. Oh, that's gonna be annoying to configure. Oh, not really, because I can put it in... Can I put it in the home? If I can put them in home, that'd be a lot easier to do send over an egg at a time from home. I'm trying to marry and hope to learn. But with the egg lock, do I still get the other Nuzlocke rules, can I still catch a Pokemon every route, or is it only used to get? Only egg. Hmm. That's a, that's a little harder, like, it's, like, relatively the same hardness. It's just, that will be annoying. <laughs> oh boy, that'll be fun. Egg run.
Jensen did not peak at 15. Jensen is still peaking. All Jensen does is peak. He won't ever evolve. He won't ever get better. He won't peak ultra, but he will peak. I still think, like, the, the run has already peaked with the first death being someone, or the second death really, being someone who double slapped five times and got crit on the last three. Like, I haven't seen that ever in any Pokemon game. If I can find someone who double slaps and gets crit on every hit, that would be the ultimate, like, that. That's the Pokemon god. Fuck Arceus. Whoever that Pokemon is, has been... is rightfully in charge. I don't think... I don't think Arceus can even learn double hit. Hit five times and I think it says double in it? As ultimate. What What the shit? Nido King's got double kick. He only kicks twice. Disrespectful. Dante is gonna zoom, man. He grew up so fast in this champ. Can we stop with the fucking poison? I'm sick of it. Uh, Dante, Dante, Dante. <laughs> I envy. Yeah, so, next is Team Rocket. I don't think I need to switch out any of my party at the moment. If I did, it'd be for Voltorb, but I actually might switch that out for Voltorb to rename him now while I'm here. He could... He could gamble. How many people want to see me gamble, though? Like, who wants to sit down and watch me gamble for an hour and a bit to get a Tratini? Like, I don't think that's going to be fun for anyone. It's not Gen 4 when you can play smart. Gen 4 is just Minesweeper. You can you can be smart at Minesweeper. You can't be smart at, like, a random slot. I mean, you can, there's people who have been, but... You can't be slot, smart for a Pokemon. Or is there? Is there a surefire method to win all the time? The egg has fallen me asleep. One of the Pokemon in the Egg Nuzzle has to be executed. Either variant, it doesn't matter to me. What other Egg Pokemon? Togepi? It has to be a Togepi. Get up, Dante, buddy. Get up! Thank you, Dante. Alright, heal, and let's do the gym. I'm gonna quickly fix something because I'm noticing it on the stream end. It's a little annoying. Just make it long. Here we go. There we go. That looks better to me. I switched out the. I made the gym case smaller because you couldn't see the last letter sometimes, the first letter on the second line. So I just wanted to. Make it look a little bit cleaner. It only took me three episodes, too. So, this fight, I'm gonna keep Dante in for as long as I can without switching him out. Uh, and then I will. And then I will. Uh... Yeah. Yeah, and then I'll switch into the other two. Being Jensen and Storm, I think they'll carry the rest. Um, I can also... Oh, another thing, I bought the bike voucher on the reset. I, f I remembered to talk to the dude to get the bike. 
So, we'll go do that at some point. We'll go get the bike again. Um, yeah. So we can get the stones we need here. And a bunch of other things. I don't remember this store very much. Cause I don't often spend time in Celadon. Hello, sir. Oh, hyperbeam dig. Brick break is good. Sick pal. Trapped. Hello, sir. May you have good moves? You have great balls, though. I really like some great balls. That's enough. And then we go up here and talk. Counter. Jensen can learn counter? Rickard can learn counter? Let's have a look at what Rick counter is exactly. Retaliation with the counter is any physical hit with double the damage. No, I think double kick's better. Yeah, nah, I should. Yeah, sorry. I'll learn counter another time. These nerds playing Pokemon in Pokemon World. Why would, why, would, uh, why would I do that? Why am I an idiot? Savage animal idiot. Hello, sir. Provide me with your strongest of fire stones. And your leafest of leaf stones. Thank you, sir. You're about to see something magical. Because of this, I'll let you do this. I'll let you watch. I don't let most people watch. It's creepy. So you can watch since you gave me it. Let's go! Vileplume! I'm aware to it. I'm aware when I'm gonna evolve. Sing. Okay, let's have a look at his stats now. Chlorophyll, still good. 59 attack, 50 defense, 67 special. Is that stronger than Jensen? Jensen's a beast. Look at that. 88. Yeah, she's very good. She will be very helpful. So, uh, I'll go to the last area. I don't think there's anything up there. Oh no, there's the. Yeah, get the EV as well. Hello, sir. You here to give me medicine? No, I don't want any of that. Mm, maybe. Maybe later. Steady. I don't know if you can actually fix a drink. Might be able to. I don't remember. Well, that was a department store. Find everything you need in a department store. So, after this, what I think I'll do is I'll get the EV and then I'll do the Team Rocket thing. I don't think friendship is a mechanic until 
after Sevi Islands in this game. I'm not even sure if they just have it at all. So I don't think I can, I don't even know if I can get Umbreon and Espeon. So Eevee might just stay in Eevee until someone dies. What have we got? Uh, 26, 29s? Yeah, we should be fine. Do I need to fight you? Save treatment. This is good. So I've wasted the hype potion now. So that's a good thing. But I'll roll some chat after this hit. Yep. He did his best. Future site worth it. 80. But it's what? Three turns? Two turns after. Over teleport? I wasn't teleporting before. Holy shit, I was an idiot that entire grind session. Oh. I think for ease of service, I'll keep teleporting my future site later. Oh, both of them were 29. Interesting. Give that to to Raf. Giga Drain. That'd be a good move for her to know. 
Yeah, gym cleared. That's great. That only took an hour. That's pretty good. Making good time today. So, I think we will now get the AV. See if we can name him here. It's either here or Saf, and we can rename. Uh, we can rename Voltorb to Thing since the reset. Um, I should also have a look at Route Seven. I don't think I get anything on Route Seven. If I'm remembering correctly, um, I think I have everything that I can catch. Which, if that's the case, it'll be a dead route until like it calls for me to count, uh, like, the game, like, requires me to continue. Yes, yeah, so just quickly having a look. Pokemon in Route 7 include, but are not limited to, Meowth, Pidgey, Bellsprout, and Grove. So everyone we have, so we're not going there. Now, the real question is... Well, according to the thing, we have to go... Like, it's Sabrina. Right? No, that's the Fusion Gym. Badge, I think. Okay. Let's go get Eevee. And other things while we're here. Ba -ba, ba -ba 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 -ba. I'm gonna need room, aren't I? One second, I'm gonna need room. I made the terrible mistake of not thinking before I did my thing, my actions. Stole this dude's Eevee. Boy Eevee. Not very rare. Um. Let's go with. Ver. Ver. Ver there. Let's have a look at Volu, see what they have for us today. Runaway, fair, impish nature. Impish, the impish nature is a nature that, uh, that someone has already, I believe. Uh, decreases special attack and raises defense. So that's not good for any of the evolutions. At all. Really. Probably good for Vaporeon. Vaporeon's a very tanky evolution, so. Might be that one. That might be the choice. Uh. 
It found the ether. Uh, what about Zappy Zap? Well, Jolteon is good for the team in the in the way that it fills the gap we don't currently have. But uh, he's a fast and lightning boy, so that's that's a good thing to have. But we do have Yar Born for that. Um, so I don't actually know what I want to use. Self scout. Hello, sir. I believe you have the self scout. Oh, uh, he punched me. Dude, there's a basement. You know what, dude? I'll take this off your hands, because on the one side, I don't think you should be gambling anyway, but on the other side, there's a Dratini there, and it's kind of got my name on it. We did it, we got two cherry ones. We made a dollar. Yeah, no more game one. Might do that on my off time. The gambling for Pokemon just so I don't pull you guys. is Fuchsia, Fuchsia City Gym, which means that Jensen will be doing a lot of the work as well as Rickard. After this fight, I'll go fill up and quickly call a little bio break for myself. Need some water, maybe snack on it would be bad. Question is, do we use this area to level up? To level up, um, Nahi. Nahi levels up at 25. And then we've got no more caves that we need to worry about. Do we do that before we hit any of the other caves? Which I don't think there's many. For now, I'm not going to bother, uh, but I will make do with that later. So yeah, I think I'm going to quickly go to toilet and have some food, uh, and I'll be back in maybe five minutes. So for now, I will listen to some sweet jams.
Polka Center. That's one of my favorite songs. And so appropriate where we stopped. So, we shall continue on our journey. I was not paying attention to how many times you did tell of it. That was my fault. My hubris almost got me. This is the Pokemon Stadium music. Pokemon Stadium. Went to mini games. I think so. I don't remember. Team Rocket is an interesting group in Pokemon. It's like... No, it was the first, but it's also just it's nice having simplicity of Team Rocket being... They sort of just want to take over the world, uh, and steal Pokemon. And like, not even necessarily take over the world, just like... Steal Pokemon and get super powerful. So, like, they'll take over the world just because of that reason alone. Another interesting concept, and before they've gone a little crazy with the last... Well, not the last one. Sword and Shield had an interesting concept for the villain. Spoiler alert, if you haven't played base fucking Sword and Shield. Um, but, like, the Switch... It was like, I saw the Switch coming, because I saw the Switch coming in, uh, in Sun and Moon with the Aether Foundation, or I knew that was gonna be the main thing there. Um, but it's an interesting, uh, Switch, and like, it's an interesting premise that he's, that he's, that someone is dealing with a future problem now. Um, but it will cause harm, sort of deal. That's an interesting concept. Uh, but I'm, I'm mainly talking about, like... 
uh, Gen... Like, Gen 6 is probably the most... Gen 6 and Gen 3 have the most, like... Unbelievable, I'll say. Thanks for the raid, Panda T. Uh, not Panda T. Rorik 2, with Panda T coming in with that. Thanks, guys. Um, but yeah, then... I'll say they're the least, like, weird... They're, like, the least... The least weird... Um... Concepts. Like, they were like, We want to rule the world and make it a beautiful place. Like, on, on the one side. Nuzlocke is going well. We've only lost four Pokemon. We've beaten the fourth gym. And we're currently... Uh, having some fun in the... <laughs> so I saw someone there. Uh, well, currently in Team Rocket Base, uh, in Saladon. So, yeah. Other than that, we're going pretty strong. Yes, he's... Nidoking has been the one of the champions of the run so far. Bum, 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 bum. But yeah, so Gen 3 and Gen 6 had like weird villains, like just on like the concept of we want to flood the world so there's like more water and then there's, we want to get rid of the water so there's more land. That's like, just a, that's a silly, that's a silly concept, but it's also a very fun concept to have uh, as a villain. Neokin is a very good choice for a favorite Pokemon. I do. Quite well. But like, the nice simplicity of Team Rocket being like, we just want money and Pokemon. We win. Like, we'll be in charge because, like, you can't stop us sort of deal. Um. Yeah. All the other, like, all the, all the Pokemon villains are very fun and interesting. Uh, in the regard that, like, the motives are uh, interesting to have a look at and explore. These puzzles are my bane, but I'm remembering. What's everyone's favourite Pokemon? Nido King, I know, is a lot of people's favourite Pokemon just because of the design. Um, what's everyone else's? I did a thing at the start of the year where I like went through every gen and then chose a favorite for every type. Don't remember the results exactly. I think it just ended up being Toxtricity. Like I, I think Toxtricity is a very fun uh, Pokemon to have. A very cool concept. And then I think second is Gardevoir. Just, again, both are very interesting concepts. Gen 1 favorite is Eevee and Dragonite. Good times. Dragonite is a very... It's a very fun Pokemon, but I don't often get to use them. I don't often use uh, Dragon-type Pokemon like that because they tend to be late game. Like, they tend to come at you really late. Um, there's some exceptions with, like, Gible, Gible, however you want to pronounce it. I see them all the time uh, at the start of Platinum and stuff. But, like, Dragon types tend to be around that, like, mid to late level when you set up a thing. Gen 1, it's a good gen. I'm not really, I never actually played Gen 1. Um, like, Red, blue, and yellow by itself. I've only ever played the Gen 3 remakes of it. Every Dragon Knight's book. Interesting. The dragons are a very cool concept. I uh, like a lot of the. The newer the dragons have been very fun. Um. I've been playing Pixamon, and uh, my friend is making a mustache team, and so they were like, oh, what's Super Pokemon with a mustache? And my other friend recommended Drampa. And 
Apparently Dramper is a surprisingly good like sweep up. It is like ridiculous special attack or something. And that's that's just fun to me. Duraludon is a very fun skyscraper that pretends to be a dragon. Drapey is just a cool design, I love Drapey. In the, in the topic of gens, I think I'm probably... I think a Gen 4 is my favourite gen. Both Heart, Skull, uh, Both Heart Gold, Soul Silver, and Platinum have been, like, I find are fantastic games. Uh, they are a little bit slow to get through, but they are very fun. Someone's favourite is Mr. Mime is. That'd be a wild card. They are... I'm sort of a little turned off from Mr. Mime because of... Again, the Pixelmon server. Back in, like, early release of Pixelmon, um... Just, you were sleeping at night, and then there'd be a Mr. Mime outside your house going, Mr. Mime! And you're like, I don't, I don't feel okay. Someone help. It was, it was a very creepy voice line they gave him right at the start. Which is weird, because he shouldn't be speaking, because he's a goddamn mime. He gets used in... I've read he gets used in the latest Pokemon uh, show. Um, which is interesting. Like, they get Ash to use him in a fight. And I'm like, that's a, that's a nice thing. Like, I like how they brought Mr. Mime into Ash's team for a little bit, even if it was only, like, one thing. They really, like, they really made it... They made him very interesting in Sword and Shield with making him part ice as the Galarian form. And Mr. Rhyme is also just such a fun looking Pokemon. He's got the bowler hat, he's got the mustache, he's ready to party. Plus he's a gentleman. Don't be creepy if you're a gentleman, that's illegal. I got the other later. No ever later for me. Alright. I was up, I need to down buddy. Mr. Rhyme! But they do make a cute Mime Junior. Mime Junior is a very cute Pokemon. Most of the baby types are. You know what, I feel up Dante since I'm apparently not going up to heal. You should get some sleep! Night, Nicola. Five thirty AM. They gotta be America? America. Probably. Cause right now it's eight o'clock at night. Over here in Australia land. Good kit rap. Night night. Night Not hyper. Hyper's bad. Super good. Oh. Around. 
Sup, dude? How's everyone's day been? I was pretty well. I had some time to relax. I almost beat Hades in my first run of Hades. Not my, like... Not my first run of Hades. My first time getting to Hades. I almost beat him. Which is very nice. So, I have, I'm riding on that high a little. But... Would have been better if I won. Size there. If at all. They just mumbled into, mumbled into a microphone like I'm doing apparently. Black glasses is good. Down the hole. Max Ethan. Hey boy. Yeah, man, I want to know who needs uh, this. I want to go use it. and then asked you how to. Soy. Such a silly dude. Alright, now I will. Struggle hours is what I'll do. Wait for it. Okay. In frustration, the one that is better if you don't like your trainer. They must have the mechanic in them. I think it's just not accessible till afterwards. Right? Frustrations wanna know? Yeah. Was that implemented? Was the friendship system implemented in Gen 1? Or just not utilized in the way that we use it now? For evolutions? Could that be interesting? I guess they wanted to make it so like, yeah, these guys are your friends and, and or pets, however you think of them. And they grow to like you.
the best with the mouse. Do I look like a mouse, my dude? I look like a big boy. Gonna disable in my fight. Both of them. Now for Goron and Fuchsia, the question is which way do I want to go? Because first of all, I'm going to go to get the bike anyway. Do I want to go down the scenic route? Grab the... Grab the flute, go through Lavender Town. Get a Ghastly, maybe? That'd be nice. Or do I want to go down bike away? And deal with all the bike Pokemon trainers. Calcium. The beauty of evil. Hmm. Evil is pretty good. But food is also pretty good. No paralysis for you. Bante is caught up now, so this is not more fun. I should, while we're in this battle, quickly have a look at what level I need to stop at. So yeah, again with the Fuchsia Gym, Jensen and Rickard are going to be doing the most of the work. Dante has fulfilled his part and is a reasonable member of my society. Uh, Fuchsia Gym Leader is Koga. Chabaka. Chabaka. Gen 3. This highest is 43, so I don't want to go any higher than that. Are we supposed to use Sabrina first? For numbers? Let's have a look. I did ruin your plans on that moon. Forty three for her as well. So the same levels, so we can choose. I 
I should have gone Raph. Raph hasn't been able to fight anything like you. Attack is very annoying, size slash just delaying your death. Well, not death. Again, only I die in the Nuzlocke. The Pokemon I'm fighting, they're, they're fine afterwards. Well, that cursed or something is the reasoning I have for a Nuzlocke run. Mm, Dante. Silkscope here, right? I'm trying to remember. Because the Master Ball is in Saffron. Again, with the Master... Uh, not again, he hasn't said it. But with the Master Ball, I am just throwing that ball at the next available Pokemon we can catch. Because I, I generally don't use Master Balls anyway. I think the part of the fun of the Legendary is trying to catch it on your own without just going for it unless you like run out of balls. I tend not to use them, so I'm gonna just tear them out whatever. And by god, will will be the strongest Pokemon. If we go the way I want to go for Fuchsia City, we have the best way to get, um... to get um, the, the best way to grind. Uh, it's one of the better areas to grind with the Verse Seeker because you can get uh, quite a lot of them up. I think the only other better one is very rare at the start of the day. Might only make this a three hour stream instead of a four hour stream just because it's a sort little of hot in here and I would like to get up and move around without dying. Yeah, so I might only go to 10 as opposed to my usual 11. Or 10 or 10 30. Figure it out when we get closer to the time. I need to hang out right now. Right, right. Now to wait Giovanni on the day of his Pokemon's birthday. I should have made it for that. My bad. <coughs> Just grabbing some water. Look at that boy. My goal is to get another evolution tonight. I think. I think just as a side goal, if I can get another evolution tonight, that'd be good.
Kangushka. Perfect job. Let's go play my ultimate technique. Got to learn it from this dude, bro. He just knows it. That's it. Alright, I'm bringing in the big gun. For you, second pick for you. Stupid, you've only poisoned yourself. This isn't the hill you want to die on with a tail whip? Weird. Weird, weird, weird. It's time to go catch some ghosts. So the most annoying thing now is grain fight. That's the next big thing is the grain fight. Uh, we have a lot of everything to deal with this team. Our team is very widespread in typing. So we generally have the edge here. Again, I might do the, the gambling on my own just because it is annoying and I don't think anyone would want to watch me do that for an hour straight so no gambling but uh I'm definitely so we'll go back to Adam Town and we'll go through uh, the graveyard which has the best music so I don't think I'll be changing it Oh, you're fucking... Oh, wait, no, the tea. I can get the tea. I can do this. I can give you tea. I remember now. Don't forget to give the tea, AJ. Silly Skyflourish, AJ Quinn. You can do both. You can get the tea and... Thanks for the tea, lady. You're very nice. I should give that to that guy. If this was a choice, I'd either give it to the little kid or give it to the guards towers and you have to make that choice. That'd be, that'd be a weird thing to do. But I'd also maybe kinda like it. Now choose Spider-Man! And we have this dude we can fight up here. You can get a fighting Pokemon, dude. I think we'll wait on wait a bit for that. But now we get the bike. Ba -da 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 -da. I would like to purchase to find a spice of cool. Oh. Not even a purchase. You lost some money there, buddy. You okay? Alright, lavender down. Gonna be some ghost hunters. Hunting the ghosts. Look how good I am at bicycling. 
Da -da -da -da. How do I look faster coming up and down than I do? Metal Lavender Town theme. This te this thing is a very good theme as well, but I meant the Lavender Town theme about the best song in the game. It's a very nice melody, a very creepy melody. So my friend, am I ready? We're all the same level-ish. Yeah, I think we're good to go. Dante is a good starter than any. No, you make them dead if you kill them. I mean, you bastard. Pizza pizza. Think about what the best one was there, the raft for her raft only does one times because of the part flying that Gyarados gets. But if I bite, I have the chance to flinch. You know, he's gonna hurt himself. Yourself, please. Okay. Oh! Alright, nope. Nope, 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 nope. I have not lost a starter once in a Nuzlocke, and I'm not doing it again. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it ever. I'm not, I'm not losing a starter. That's what happens. That's what happens when you hurt yourself. Nickel shall crush you like a baby of mine. A baby of mine, that's rude. Just hurt him a little. You thrash against him. Silly girl, if you are near puppy, I am big boy. Oh, obviously. He hasn't seen it yet. It's a good place for Storm to get some level. I like in the later games the sprites that have the closed eyes to signify they're asleep. That's just a nice touch. Oh, not a good sleep. That was almost close. We almost lost a Koara there. Again, that was my 
bad choice making, but in the end it worked out, but it might not have lasted. What's wrong, level 30? Are you 30 or 32? I think you're 32. You might even be 36. Fidget is, is a number I don't remember often. You took... Okay, so the Cuban like, just died a couple weeks ago. You came in here... Another Cuban, the Marowak. And you come in here and you take one of their own away from their brethren. It's kind of fucked up, mate. <laughs> Since we are in the catch zone... We shall, uh, put our catcher up. So she can't cut. She's got slow cutter. I'm also going to sort this out so my brain isn't mad at myself. Like a spirit to you? Okay, you know what? Maybe I do. Jensen is a good thing in this place because he can go in quickly and hit, but you don't want to risk the nightshade. Um. So I think Aquara or Dante is actually a little better and I've got Lego Bite and won't, won't, won't just die. Because Ghost is physical in this game and he does not have the not have the the, the Healy the Healy for the defense to counter that. Gas Kali. So no gas. My Kali can hit to me famous TV show. The good thing about this place is I've got the healing circles, I think. So, like, even if you spend a decent amount of time here, they'll heal you up for it. Come cursed like me. Whee! Pretty weird, aren't they? I'm 
day by trade. I'm getting a little too warm in here, so I'll probably only go for another hour. I'd like to go for four hours, but summer is hot. And we are fast approaching the dreaded summer, but we can get a front heel. Gus, female ghost. Attack and then balls because it's always got the option to curse itself to death, so I don't want to do that. She's pretty great. Triple wiggle. Indian elephant by enveloping the prey in two seconds. Money? The fuck? Um, ghost girl, huh? Just thinking you're really sick and playing a lot of Hades, but it's, I mean, it's sort of relevant, but it's also not. I go along the soul lane. Yeah, go sign around and get marker. Marker from Soul Eater. A crazy marker. Crane would have been better. Crane would have been a better name. Because Crane was a crazy character. My the show are very different for Soul Eater. I think I prefer the manga uh, ending to the TV show ending, just because a few more thematic things about it, but other than that, a good watch or, or read. Either way, fun experience. Cast are very fun. I don't think, uh, yeah, the cast characters are very fun. Bait. Now that we've captured something, uh, Dante can go back up to the top. Because he will be faster than most things here. Him or Jensen can go up to the top now without, uh, it's just switching in, that's the problem. Because they will typically be faster than anything they fight in here. Typically. Not always. Some of these guys might have pretty fast Pokemon. Can you outrun a ghost? Yes. Yes, I can. So after the two gems that I'm more careful, we've got the lane. Which is an acquire and a Rickard thing. So you got splash fire, right? Yeah. So the three of them could go into that fight relatively well. Same as his special is slightly higher than his attack. 
Both are relatively good though. He is the hitter of the group. I think we fought for her. Should double check, but I think we've done her already. If I'm standing ladder or anything like that's because I'm moving back and forth. I'm leaning into the desk to position myself better. I don't know what I want to do with the game tonight. Okay, eggs, maybe? Circle. Good. Clear everyone, then we'll just stand in here circle. I shall join them? Dude. Sounds like fun. This time I'll remember to say. Remind me, chat, to save after this. Like, not this fire at the end of the stream. I don't want to redo everything again. It's a little too much. Give me your all. Okay. So far my all seems to be this little dog who can one shot all your things. This might be a natural thing. I love the glow around his hand in this sprite. It's my favorite, like, this is Haunter's sprite and one of my favorite sprites in the game. Just because of that little touch of this like, thing. I will win. I'll win. I'll do the game. I'll win the game. I'll do it all. I healed. Nice. If anyone had a Pokemon in real life, what would they want it to be? Like, Growlithe is an obvious, like, collective people choice. It's just a dog. It's just a big old boy. He doesn't even have extremities on fire, it just sometimes has fire. But like, I don't know. For me, it's like Bulbasaur or, or Turtwig or Trico. Like, Trico would be like. Having a full grown Torterra would be a hassle. I love him, but like, he's big. <laughs> you need some room for that. Um, but like. I don't know. Venusaur is the same thing. They're pretty big. But like. Skeptile is just like, he can chill out in the tree. Blood? Alright, we went a little too far. Alright, the other guys invited me to a party. I was preparing, and then he like, gave me blood. I don't want blood. I don't have blood to give. I already lost Pokemon. Not today. I can make this the only run that no, no you're on the only session without Pokemon dying. We happy. I mean, I mean technically it wouldn't really be a full length. It wouldn't be the same that could be comparable to the other three because I haven't played for another hour. But I lose stuff at the start of sessions. I don't lose them at the end of sessions. So I think it's fun. Dante wants to learn Flame Whale. Uh, yes. Over Ember. That's actually a cool trick. 40 or 60. Again, there's no physical special split in Gen 3, so it's literally just a 1 for 1 what's higher or has what other effects. Um, that's the point. So I can just be like, this is a bigger number, therefore better. Or this has a better ability, therefore better. I don't have to worry about numbers yet. Which I like in Gen 4 and onwards. The numbers of like, the special split is probably my favorite choice that they made. Just cause of 
like, the variety of, like, moves and stuff that came out of it. Yeah, so Dante won't level up till probably 49, I won't evolve until then. Flamethrower is very good. It's a Marowak, but... Fuck off from you, please. This is a holy place, we don't need your arseholes like just running around.
should not keep my eyes open. But I shall endeavor to try. I'm not getting away with this. Huh. Now I can get a snow lakes. Hello. Oh. I never used to go down. Like, I don't know how good they can be. I know they get, I think they get the 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 horn one hit KO was seeking, but I don't know how good that line is. It's the boy. It's my boy. Probably right. Best boy. Third member of the best boy group so far. That contains uh, Bulbasaur, Turtwig, Marie, and all that. All the boys.
Good blue team is Pokemon that can't commit a crime. They're just they are always good. Outside this is when your soul, or the soul of your foot is sketchy and it's already in the shoe. Like, I can't scratch it, I can't do anything, I just have to suffer. Pain. Mate, I was gonna fight you anyway, but you just came here. I think I'll aim for 38-ish. The highest I can be is 43, but I think I'll aim for the group to be around 38 uh, by the time I fight uh, Kroko. That's his name. Don't wear it out. Shoulder a lot, and I don't know if it's because I like the design or the concept, but I think it might be related to like when I was a kid. We had um, the yellow cassette of Pokemon uh, with the, the Pikachu episode in it, and I, know, I, think, I think one of the episodes on that VCR was uh, the one where they learn about the Slowpokes evolving with the uh, with shoulder. I don't remember that line. Like how I don't really remember the ways, but I remember how it was delivered, and I'm like, even to this day, I'm like, fuck, I must have watched that a lot. Raph, go to level 32. Thanks, Raph. Raph is in Raphaelio, however that flower's pronounced. 16 hours? Cheeks. Lots of good times that I leave it up accidentally for a little bit. That's right, I said Jigus in my filthy home stuff. And me now.
soon. Oh, let's go heal. No, I said that he's an event partner. So technically it's not going against the rats, because this is like a matter of progress. Uh, but I might roll a day 100 uh, for these types of events uh, to see if they count. I feel like that's only fair. Go for a high or low on what's happening there. Attacked in a grumpy rage, just like me when I wake up, except I grumpily go to the toilet. And then go back to sleep. <laughs> Don't wake me up, is all I'm saying. I wanna wake up. Oh my I'm a good kid. I know how to do it.
I am very upset. using snow. I can play this whole game all day with fucking Snow Axe. She's getting on the team. She has to see what she's brought.
Hey everyone, this meat pain. Shows the better choice. We say goodbye to Storm and to Richard. To second and third oldest Pokemon that I have present. I'm sorry that you died in that way. <sighs> Goodbye, Rickard. Has a bashful nature. Because look at that attack, and look at that special attack. Look at that fit fat. Head back, you on rest in this floor. Bashful Pokemon is is a nothing one. It's one of those ones that it's the same one, so there's no actual plus or minus to them. The old ball needs to train. Good fishing rod. Oh, thank you for the super rod. Taking hits now.
gonna be quiet for the rest of the thing, aren't I? Just cause I'm, I'm mad, I'm annoyed. I don't know what the title should be for the YouTube upload. I don't know if it should be Pain, just normally spelled. Or King Slayer. <sighs> While Pain will probably make a permanent member of the team, just given that Snorlaxes are very good. I don't think your born will be, unless something bad happens. Uh, he's here right now to to level up, because I might as well level be leveling someone up. Um, so he does not have much of a grind later. But, um... But mainly... I think we're gonna be refilling a lot of Pokemon when we get to... Um... The Safari Zone. So, for now, I think it's fine. I might fish for a, a Dragonite then, and the Safari is in one of the areas. Because I think I'm going to run that with, um... With three rules. Uh, with, uh, one for each zone area. I should quickly, uh, roll a die on the... On if this is a... Count, so if I can catch another Pokemon, because of Pain being an event one. Just because. Yeah, so I've got my 2d10. Uh, higher than. Uh, higher than 50. Uh, 51 and up. I'll treat this as a dead rat. And then. 50 and lower, we'll treat it as. Uh, treat it as a catchable area. 40. That's pretty good. Alright, we'll get a free person here. Um, I don't know if I want to go Super Rod or not. Super Rod is pretty... What are you doing? But, uh... How are you doing? What are you doing? There's also this. Let's try this out for a bit. See if there's anything new in here. I need another flyer. I think that's what a revolt will be replaced by. Uh, flying types is pretty good at getting rid of the grass types. I don't really have anything to do that. Oh, well, now I've got Wrath, but I mean, flying is just a good skill to have. I typically like flying Pokemon. Let's see what we can do in the last 15 minutes of the game. And we get a new friend. Don't show me that right now. You crazy.
get a better knife. I can fish for a horsey with a good rod. Or a side up with a super rod. Uh, I think. Bloodthirst you today, it's going off to everyone I love. Uh, this last this last part of the stream has been just it's not good watching. I'm not talking, I'm not really making conversation, I'm just being annoyed and mad and upset. Cause like, it was Rickard. Rickard did so much part two. He, he grew up, he got strong. He watched Jagger die in front of him and then vowed to get revenge and prove that he can be the ruler he truly needs to be. Got coronated and then we took on the boat. He, he just destroyed Lieutenant Surge's gym. And for what? To be taken out by a lucky strike from a Snorlax who wouldn't get him the ball?
Veteran Knack, the insect Pokemon. Its eyes act as a radar, enabling it to be active in the darkness. The eyes can also shoot powerful beams. Well, if I wanted to keep up with the Twitch Place Pokemon in Big World ATV, I always really like the design of the eyes. But they lose it, but the purple is a nice colour too, so... Uh... I think I will go to the thing and call it a bit early. Five minutes early than I thought I would. But yeah, thanks for coming today. I mean, it was a good thing up until about 20 minutes ago. I'm so mad. <laughs> um. Serious nature. Uh, I'll make a decision over the break, the one week break, to see uh, what I want from it in terms of if it can learn fly or not, or if its typing is going to be good. Because I know it's going to be good for Sabrina, and it will be very resistant against uh, Koga right now. Compound A is good. Uh, but I wanted to check the, the nature. I think it's a good nature for it. Sirius is... Uh, is it blank nature? No, so it's not the worst, but yeah, it's still good. Uh, so I'll choose if I'm going to switch her out for the old ball one. Uh, but... Uh, for now I think it's time we say goodbye. I cool down in a couple ways. In a uh, cool down from anger and from being in... What is it? What? Uh, I cool off from being in 26 degree heat, I reckon. Yeah. So, see you next time. Bye.